Hey VC, it's Trevor back with another flat round and spun. Uh, this is my first time gonna attempt to start a thread and perhaps everyone else can play along. Um, gonna go with uh, album title theme, which I know is not the most original thing, but you know, we've seen album titles with a single word, two words, three words, four words. Uh, but this I want to go with uh, lengthy titles um, sometimes uh, you know they're so long that we just either give it initials or uh, especially when we type them out or uh, abbreviate them or sometimes just give them another name altogether so um, I figure do like three four five or ten if you want uh, but this is for long album titles. Uh, the first one I'd like to do is one of my, actually all these are favorites of mine of course, but uh, this one is from 1989 from Ministry. The mind is a terrible thing to taste. Get that ring out of there. Um, for you kids, you might not know the, the pun to this, but uh, back in the 80s, there was a public service announcement uh, and it showed a frying pan on a stove and it said, this is drugs. And then someone crack an egg and throw it in there and it starts sizzling. This is your brain on drugs. And the tagline was, the, the mind is a terrible thing to waste. Well, this is, the mind is a terrible thing to taste. That's when Al Jurgensen started to get real punny with his uh, titles. And he has since gone on to do dozens of them that get all punny. But this one is a fantastic album. Uh, with the exception of the song Test, which if it was an instrumental, it'd be the perfect album. But anyway, that's the first one. Next is... A uh, legendary crossover hardcore metal band from this area in the Seattle area. Uh, I believe this is from 1987, uh, but this is The Accused. More fun than an open casket funeral with all a bunch of shenanigans on the cover there. Uh, I remember hearing this in high school. I, I, I remember going off campus for lunch at some kid's house and he busted this out and uh, I was deep into thrash in the 80s, as you can tell. Um, but uh, yeah, this was one that really stuck in my mind, especially with a title like that. The Accused. Next is kind of speaking of Metallica, uh, a lot of people call this the, the Revenge album. Uh, this is the debut album from Megadeth. Killing is My Business and Business is Good from 1985. Uh, this is the last produced one um, where uh, Dave remixed it. And honestly, this sounds tremendous. I know they, they, he did some remixes in, the, in 2004 of like all the Megadeth albums. And a lot of us found them to be subpar, but this one is stellar honestly the the original mix of this from 1985 i didn't like it so i didn't like the album i mean the songs were good but the production was bad but uh this one uh the final kill if you can find it um check it out and here's shayla making an appearance here hi sweetie you want to be in a video here lift up hi say hi to shayla <laughs> And then lastly, uh, I discovered this group on uh, the soundtrack to Less Than Zero and uh, kind of out, out of my wheelhouse at the time. I wasn't uh, a big fan of the genre, but uh, warmed up to it when they collaborated with Anthrax a few years later with the same song that's on uh, the Less Than Zero soundtrack, and that would be Public Enemy. Uh, this is, it takes a nation of millions to hold us back. Uh, this is a great record. I mean, I could see why the guys from Anthrax were into this group because, I mean, it is hard as metal. Uh, in fact, uh, on the song, she watched Channel Zero 
Um, there is a, a riff lifted from uh, Slayer's Angel of Death on there. So, but we're gonna be. So, that's the thread. If you want to play along, please do. And uh, I just want to say something uh, totally off topic, but um, I shot a video about I don't know almost 18 months ago doing a ranking video of uh, my, of all the Faith No More albums, and. Uh, you know, it kind of ran its course, you know, the few weeks after I did it and went dormant. And then all of a sudden, the last two months, it went from like 400 views to almost 3,000 in the last two months. I have no idea why. But uh, I, whoever's been watching them, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, and hope you, hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, now I just got to get more... Uh, artist catalogs I could do ranking videos I don't have complete catalogs on a lot of them so uh, unless I go up in the attic and grab a bunch of CDs and I don't really want to do that so anyway again thank you guys and uh, we will talk to you later see ya